today I'm unboxing Dell's Inspiron 5759 laptop. The specification of this machine is it has a Intel Core i5 6200U processor which has uh, 3 meg of cache and runs up to 2.8 gigahertz. I believe this is the 6th generation Intel uh, chip. It has 8 gigabytes of DDR3L 1600 megahertz RAM in a configuration of 2 4 gigabyte sticks. It has a 1 terabyte 5400 RPM SATA hard drive. It has a AMD Radeon R5 M335 4 gigabyte DDR3 uh, dedicated graphics card on this machine. The screen is a 17.3 inch LED backlit display running at a resolution of 1920 by 1080. And the operating system should be Windows 10 64 bit. I did ask the supplier to do one configuration change prior to shipping the machine and that was to replace the 1TB 5400 SATA hard drive which comes as standard with a solid state hard drive. We went for a 128 gig model, uh, a KC400, just to speed up things a little. The laptop weighs around about 3 kilograms. The top cover has a rough plastic finish. There's not much to be seen on the front edge of the laptop. On the right hand edge we have a 3.5mm headphone jack, um, two USB ports, a DVD drive and a Kensington lock on the back of the laptop. Again there's not much to be seen other than two hinges. On the left hand side of the laptop we have a power socket, an ethernet port, a HDMI port, another USB port and a SD card reader. On the back of the laptop we have not much to be seen other than some product information and a battery release clip. Now we're just going to run some quick boot up tests. Uh, do bear in mind that we have replaced the stock hard drive uh, with a SSD drive. This is the first time we've actually booted up this machine.